Okay, fine. This is how you connect your Zoo wallet to your seed. You copy the link I paste on the group. You put it on your Mrs. or Kiwi browser. You load it. After you upload it, it will show like this. And make sure the browser, the Kiwi or Mrs. browser, or Lemma browser, is on desktop site. So once you have done, you log in your Telegram. When you click on Telegram, it will take you to Telegram. You accept. I don't have an account on this Telegram, but I just want to use it to show you how to go about it. So when you click, when you accepted, you now connect your Zoo wallet. You click connect your Zoo wallet. Now we ask for your extension. So when you click it, it will take you to create an extension. So you can see it at the down here. Extension, install your wallet extension. So when you click it, it will take you to the extension site. This is it. So you add to click add to chrome you, once it has load you, you click add to chrome i won't be creating an account but i just want to give you how you about it can do i make sure the telegram you are connecting to it is the telegram you use to mine your your seed the telegram i connected on this one is not, not what i use to connect my um my seed so after you have done you might wait for a little while to pop up but you're not going to wait for him to pop up so you click here if you're using mrs brother see it has gone to the place so when you allow it to load so initially you either you create an account if you have a zoo wallet before you can just go and copy the passphrase and paste it so if you don't have, you create another account here. So oh, these are you you import your previous Zoo wallet if you have, then you import it here. So once you have done importing it, you go back to the site. And go back to the play go and seed site. So immediately you click connect your Zoo wallet. Don't know why it's loading like this. So immediately you click connect your Zoo wallet, it will automatically you take you to the extension. You see, I have not created a wallet, that's why I saying connection error. So it will automatically take you to the extension and it will just connect as I talk.